Hey, hello guys. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can install Node.js on your Android phone and you can use it on your Android phone with the use of VS Code Editor. Okay, so for that, first of all, you need to install Ubuntu operating system or any Linux distribution on your Android phone with GUI version. So if you don't have that installed on your phone, so don't worry, I have a video link in the video description. So go and first install Ubuntu operating system on your Android phone. You can see this is my Ubuntu operating system I am using for I am using on my Android phone. So first install this. After that you can install Node.js. Okay. So to install Node.js you need to go to any web browser and go to Google and type Node.js Mahesh Technicals. You need some commands to install that. So you will get these commands from my website. Okay. So you can see when you type this query on the google you will get this article url here you can see how to install node.js on android phone so just open this article and you will you will see all the steps available here if you not found this article don't worry just click on search icon here and type node.js and press enter and now you will get this article on your screen okay so you can see that so just open this article here i'll provided all the details whatever needed to install node.js so first of all install ubuntu on your operating system okay so first of all use operating use any linux operating system on your android phone then you can easily install node.js so first of all let me check our node.js version is installed or not so just type node space dash v and press enter it so now you can see this is showing command not found it means no any version of node.js is installed on my ubuntu so first copy this command it will download node.js installer script so just paste here and paste then let me show you the file now you can see node.js.sh file is downloaded okay so now give the permissions executable permissions to that file so just copy this command paste here and press enter and let me show you now this file is in green color okay so it is perfectly working now just run this script so after running the script you will able to install that node.js on your ubuntu system so just paste here now you will see the three options install uninstall exit so we need to install that so i'm going to type one and press enter and it will take two to three minutes according to your internet connection so wait until the process complete so i just fast forward the video okay so now you can see our successfully node.js is installed with npm as well so let me check our node.js version and npm version so these commands also you will get from my website don't worry just copy and paste and you will able to use that commands as well so if you not found uh, if you still getting command not found error so don't worry just exit from your ubuntu and re-log in to your ubuntu then try to check your node.js version and it will work okay okay you can see so this is the small fix so don't worry if you run this script it will install node.js latest version on your ubuntu system without any error so i'm going to start my uh, vnc server again and let me open my gui mode now you can see i have vs code already installed on my ubuntu operating system so let me launch that application so if you don't have vs code installed on your ubuntu system so don't worry i'll show you how you can install so if you don't have ubuntu install so while installing ubuntu you will get a pop-up like this so you can easily install vs code from this or if you are using any other distributions and you want to install from scratch you can follow this article okay here you will get full step-by-step -step guide how you can install vs code on any linux distribution okay so you, you can see VS code is successfully launched. Now I'm going to open one project here. I created this project from chat GPT. So for the demonstration purpose. So in this project, I have index.js file, which have some codes, which is using 
CLI table 3 module okay so you can see this is the code so this code will appear on terminal uh, you can you can get stylus table output in the terminal using this module okay so let me first of all let me make this uh, code npm project it means node project i am going to make node project first so for that type npm space init space dash y and press enter now you can see we don't have any files here now you can see we have package.json file available it means your project is now initialized as a npm project okay let me clear the terminal now now we need to install module to work our code properly so i'm using cli table 3 module so let me install that module first so for that type npm install cli dash table 3 and press enter okay so with this way you can easily install any module whichever you want like this so i have cli table 3 module in my code that's why i'm using this command to install that module now you can see module is successfully installed you have node modules folder as well okay so now we can easily run this code and get output so to run this code let me resize my terminal to show the output properly because we don't have to see code because i generated from ChatGPT. so just type node space index.js and press enter now you can see you have successfully get output it means our code is successfully working our module is successfully working and node.js is working perfectly fine so with this way you can easily install node.js on your android phone and you can use it with vs code editor okay so it is very simple so you can use it so if you want to uninstall node.js from your system so you can do this as well because we have a script which is install and uninstall node.js so just run this script again and now this time you can select two number to uninstall node.js from your system okay so with this way you can easily install and uninstall node.js on your system with uh, using of vs code so thank you so much for watching we will meet in the next video thank you so much